Hello there. High pressure has finally given us some much needed sunshine, but clear skies by day also lead to clear skies overnight. And at this time of year, that allows the temperatures to fall away. Minus four was the story first thing Thursday morning in Braemar in Scotland. We haven't seen temperatures like that since April. The high pressure is starting to drift its way eastwards, and that will allow these weather fronts to creep in off the Atlantic as we move towards the weekend. But the story remains the same. Uh, for the next day or so, some early morning mist and fog leading to some sunny spells, but there will be some rain around, particularly later on Saturday and through Sunday. But first thing in the morning, Friday then, a lot of sunshine, a little bit of early morning fog will lift away and we keep the sunny spells for most, clouding over with showery rain into Northern Ireland and Western Scotland. Here not quite as warm, 14 degrees, but temperatures should peak down in the southeast as high as 17 Celsius, 63 Fahrenheit. Now, as we move out of Friday into the start of the weekend, here are those weather fronts starting to push in and the rain should turn heavier across Northern Ireland and for the bulk of Scotland through the day on Saturday. England and Wales should stay dry with some sunshine, perhaps some rain into uh, Cornwall by the end of the day and maybe southwest Wales. But in the sunshine, highs of 17 degrees, the winds are light southerly, so it might feel just that little bit warmer as well. But unfortunately, that rain is going to continue to push its way steadily east and it marks a change to the story and the trend as we look further ahead. So that rain will move its way steadily eastwards during the early hours of Sunday morning. Some outbreaks of showery rain continuing to push its way um, east through the early hours of Sunday, leaving a trail of showers following on behind. Obviously, with the cloud and the rain around, it's not going to be a chilly start to Sunday morning. Double digits return for many. But Sunday we'll see that rain clearing and then it's going to be a breezy day with sunny spells and scattered showers as we go through the afternoon. Some of those showers could be quite heavy as well, slowly brightening up from the southwest, but it's not expected to last. Top temperatures on Sunday between 13 and 18 degrees. The next low is pushing in as we go into the start of the new working week. So by the time we get towards a Monday, you can see these weather fronts circulating around this low pressure. We'll see one band of showery rain moving through to be replaced by yet another. So a brief lull across central and eastern areas on Monday. Plenty of showers tucking into the southwest and across Northern Ireland. The wind strengthening with it as well. So sheltered eastern areas, the best in terms of the drier weather perhaps on Monday and again those highs generally into the mid to high teens. Moving out of Monday into Tuesday that low pressure is going to move its way right across the country and then later in the week we'll need to keep a close eye on this low that's moving through. It has the remnants of some tropical moisture, has the potential to produce some very wet and windy weather. Could be that little bit further north, could be that little bit further south. At the moment current thoughts are it's going to move its way across Channel Coast. But however you look at it, as we move into the following week, it looks likely once again to, set, to turn unsettled with showers or longer spells of rain, maybe a little quieter into next weekend, but also cooler with it as well.